to be here. I do have to admit, I don't know much about American culture, but I have been told that this is a very popular and important show to do, especially for a young British actress who is hoping to make a favorable impression on the American audience. Tell me about Jerry. He's very attractive. Mm -hmm. I like him. Is that line between doctor and patient getting a little blurred? I could write an article about war babies and the girls left holding them. The shame of our soldiers and sailors. The trouble is, there are no more babies than there were before, so I'm stuck. Can't I be saved? I cried out to him, falling on my face in the grass, hugging his legs. No, he said. Love can't save you. What makes a champion tick? Me, myself, and I want to know. Not to mention my rabid readers. <laughs> so, who's feeling up to Sherry? Hmm? Should we start with the youngest? Even though I'm currently in a very well-received film, The Crying Game. Book me, Fergus. Am I to take it that's an home? And have received an Academy Award nomination for my performance in Damage. You should have killed yourself when you first realized. And then I would have been able to mourn. It would have been hard, but I would have buried you. And I would have wept. I know that many, if not most of you, are unfamiliar with my skills as an actress and performer. But hopefully, as of tonight, all that will change. Maestro? Well, that's no good, is it? Because when I throw things away, I don't want them to come back. You! Get rid of it. Um, certainly, Mum. <laughs> what else have you brought? I just want them to have a secret holiday. Makes it special. Secret? Yes, of course. But what if something should happen to them? Then where would we be? I don't think we have space. Oh, we wouldn't dream of invading wasters, Elizabeth. I know how much work you've undertaken in the garden. <laughs> Fruit and vegetables were included in the least precious one. And now I think of it, <laughs> we, we will have lots of space. I do not look to be served by the lady of the house. Oh, nor would you be. But that the servant girl has vanished. So. <sighs> Run away, like so many others. They're all leaving in fear. I do wish you wouldn't go. Oh, Virginia, the last thing you want is our noisiness. <laughs> My hopeless, clumsy boys. <laughs> Say goodbye, boys. Goodbye. He's very handsome. That must be nice for you. Why? <laughs> oh, why don't you tell them? You were there, after all. You thought I wouldn't spot him watching through the curtain. He likes to watch his wife being screwed, you see. No visitors at all must be allowed to see him. For their sake and his. Is, is that any visitor at all, is it, Mum? Yes. Oh, Look what have you done? Hey, sit. Listen. I'm in love with you. I want to marry you. Oh, Christ. What did you say? It's not okay. <laughs> you pass out where you like. But you're not getting any money until I'm satisfied that you're not an unnecessary burden on the state. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm yeah, um, yeah, my phone's broken. No. Your head broke my phone. Ford is a vital part of our economy. I am well aware of that. Then don't make us build our cars elsewhere. Are you threatening me, Mr. Tooley? Fuck her. You know what? The anime Frost can eat a fucking dick. Fucking dick. Take him down. Fuck, fuck. I felt butchered for a couple of months. Fuck. <laughs> away almost immediately, which of course doesn't happen if you have them younger. I mean, you've never lost it, have you? I want you to say something. I want you to tell him who we are. Then don't we say get anything out. to him. Don't say anything. I just look him straight in the eye and don't say anything. anything.
I'm sorry. I've embarrassed you. You're so quiet. You're a little bit shy, aren't you? I know I can make things right for you, Tom. I know I can make you happy. I promise. I told you we're separated. Yeah. I can't see anymore. I, I mean, this is the end. This is the end. I told you we'd see. <laughs> Apart. I'm not falling apart. Yes, you are. You're dangerously overweight. He is not. You have no idea what your son is going through. Okay. Why do you work at a 24 hour store? Because I lost my child and I split up with my husband and I'm afraid to go to bed every night. I mean, I would have thought that that would be really quite simple to work out. Don't call me a tart. I hate everything you did before you met me. Take two aspirins and tell me how you feel in the morning. I've been king for 20 years. I've never been defeated. I, I hope he's merciful. And that I haven't got it all wrong. You must take my place, of course. What's your name for him? Who? What do you call him, Henry, Hank, what? Uh, Mr. Stelton? Well, I don't know. I, I call him that. I mean, you're alone, nitwit. What do you call him in private? Your pet name for him. Private? Do you play croquet? Because it's usually against my principles to shoot dumb animals. Except squirrels. Yes. Bastards. I hate them with their long tails and their stupid twitchy noses! <laughs> Balls. You can't be here. I know, I know. I'm sorry. I just need to talk Will, to you. you can't be here. There was so much smoke I couldn't breathe and I couldn't... I was trying to find my way out. Oh, please! You must help me! You're pathetic. Pathetic. Always have been. Always will be. Well, why is this house stuffed to the gunnels with... Cards and telegrams. Toadying arsenicos! I love them! Why, you little tramp! Would anyone like some more coffee? How sweet. Do you play the piano? It's good news. About the Kennedy Hitler meeting. Overstepped your bounds this time, Sarah. Officer Olson wants. Tell him to wait. What do you think you're gonna do? Come in here and fix things? You don't fix things, Jack. He is the youth that is waiting to bang on my door and make an end to Master Builder soon as. And yet you wanted to shut him out. For shame, Master Builder. Yes, and I suppose it might also be a perfect time to look to the past. How on earth can one look at the past? You can't see something that's already happened. Your hair is on fire. What? He's a, an architect and designer. He's a composer and a magician. A genius. It's my fault. No, it's not. You don't know anything about it. Say to yourself, Alcohol makes me think I'm sexy, but makes me fat. Good God, aren't it? Weiner's come up with them. Oh, perhaps they're hatching some dark and desperate plot. I've no idea. I shouldn't be so black. I want to go in. I beg your pardon, ma'am, but Her Majesty is with the Prime Minister and cannot be disturbed. 
But that will not apply to her mother. Placid, darling, what happened? Now, you take a little trip to Dozyland. <laughs> You've got visitors coming, and we don't want to be all tired of prospection. Well, absolutely not, no. Too desperate, was it? Oh, no, 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 no